Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Norm from Fondog.com. Remember a couple weeks ago, a month ago, at CTA, when uh, we were on the show floor and I got to wear the, the scarf and say how things were all fierce and stuff? Yep, well, guess what? Here it is, live and in person. It's the Lotus from Sprint. We got one. Let's take it out of the box. Let's we'll see what it's all about. All right, so let's take a look. It's the Lotus. It's the flip smartphone. I don't know it's a full-on smartphone, but flip messaging phone with uh, the interesting clamshell form factor here. Let's check it out. We saw this one back in CTIA. Here's the real box in the box, manuals. Here's your recycling pouch. Again, you get a new phone. Please recycle your own phone. There are people around the world who can really use it. You think your old phone, you know, oh, it's last year, it doesn't do video, this and that. There are people in other parts of the world who this phone can really make a difference in their lives, seriously. Um, so recycle it. All right, here's a data cable. It uh, looks like a micro USB to USB data cable. And your charger. USB-based charger. The new LG LGs are uh, all like this now with the USB-based charger. USB-based charger, which is nice. And the phone itself. Underneath that, we've got a micro SD card uh, adapter. So this is just a uh, adapter you can use to take your micro SD card out of the phone, put it in the adapter, put it in your memory card reader here, Boop. and then you can plug it into your computer. And not all memory card readers make that boop sound. Mine is special, so don't be upset if yours does not make that sound. Let's look at the phone itself, though. Here's the Lotus. This is the black one. It also comes in uh, purple with the the scroll graphics around the front. But I got the black one. Two megapixel camera on the front. You've got a dedicated music button, a dedicated camera button, headphone jack, two and a half millimeter, not three and a half, but uh, headphone jack. Your micro SD card slot. This one has a card in it. It is a 512 megabyte card. So, you know, with micro SD cards these days, I don't know what this officially supports. I will look it up. But uh, you can get cards 8, 16, 32 gigs, you know, store all your stuff. Rocker switch for volume. Open it up, and there you've got the big internal display. You got an external display, of course, on the outside. Oh, I'm sorry, I didn't point out the uh, three buttons on the outside for play, pause, and track, skip back and forth. And then on the inside, you get your full QWERTY, which is nice. And uh, you know, it's small, but because the keys are buttoned and they're sort of chiclet style, uh, it feels pretty good. The keys are raised, so it, it gives more of a uh, more of a it's Saturday, I can't talk. You get more delineation between them, more separation. You know, you can feel with the raised uh, bubble which key is which. So let's power it up. That's the pattern that's on the purple one, I believe. That scrolly pattern. We checked it out back at CTIA, where I got to wear the Christian Siriano scarf. Uh, if you're interested, you can check out Noah's Bark podcast. I believe it was episode... Uh, three, maybe, or four, where we got uh, Demetra from LG came on the show talking about how the whole thing happened, where they got Christian, winner of season four Project Runway, to talk about the Lotus and the scarf and that whole thing. So check that out. Ex the external display is pretty big, pretty clear. So this is the new interface, the new uh, Sprint one-click interface, where when you scroll across your bottom row of menu options here, you get a little pop-up contextual menu. So looks pretty nice. There's navigation, there's a Google menu built in, Gmail, YouTube, there's your browser. It's a full uh, HTML browser, we'll check that out in a second. Here's your messaging, your account preferences, personalize your phone. You can personalize, they call it the carousel, so you can decide what, uh, what you want in there, which is kind of nice. Shortcuts. You know, interesting form factor. Um, just because I happen to have this is an old phone here, the Sony Ericsson K790A. Just because I happen to have it here, um, you know, you can see compared to uh, your standard phone shape, the Lotus is very different, short and wide. But uh, what's nice about it is it 
it gives you all that room you need for the full cordy there. And uh, you can see what I've got it held up to my face here. You know, it extends like a flip and it, it brings the phone down to, uh, the pe thing people like about the flips is you get the phone right down by your mouth when you're talking, it feels more like a phone. So the sliders and the flips, popular for that reason. You know, it's a little bit bigger, a little bit wider than uh, phones you might be used to. But very interesting design. So um, we will have much, much more on the fierce LG Lotus. Very soon. But for now, here's your unboxing. I'm Noah from PhoneDog.com. It's the LG Lotus. Again, check out the podcast Noah's Bark where we had Demetra from... Hi, Demetra. Is that you? Oh, no. Sorry. Where we had Demetra from, uh, from LG on talking about the Lotus, how it came to be, and uh, the whole thing with Project Runway. And we'll be back. We'll do a uh, comparison, I think, maybe with another phone that I'm not going to talk about yet. But I think this warrants a comparison with that one. And... Uh, yeah, lots more on the Lotus on PhoneDog.com. Till next time, I'm Noah. Stay fierce.